everyone it's another episode of unscripted where we give you the real talk by real people and trashing out real issues yes, yeah. 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 so today we're gonna have as usual now the interesting topic and mm. it's about body makeup body enhancement you didn't hear me right yes yeah. so it's a very controversial topic and we're going to talk about body enhancement what does it mean to you when is it too much uh, before we dive into the topic, I'm going to be introducing my friends. To my right, I have Koye. What's up? I have Tizu. It's your boy. And my sister <laughs> Kumi. And I am Titi Lope. And we're ready to dive right into the topic. So guys, hmm. all this body enhancement talk here yeah. and there. I'm sure on social media, even when you see people... Some people are really changing from what you know we used to know them to be or look like. It's a miracle. <laughs> it's a miracle. <laughs> Walking. <Thank God. laughs> but this time around, it's not uh, it's not that kind of miracle. It's people actually, you know, stepping up their games mm. in their home world. The porters huh? is doing miracles. <laughs> what do you think, Koye? Do you think it's necessary? Well, before we even go into is it necessary? necessary? Yes. Yeah. Okay. To answer the question straight and forward, yes, it's necessary. Or mm. it can be necessary. It can be necessary. Mm. It can be necessary. Okay. Uh, instances where I've seen uh, where body enhancements were called for. Uh, a clear example I remember is uh, Queen Latifah. Um, she was very... She went under the knife? Yeah, yeah, she did. She went under the knife. There was a time when she was very uh, large. Uh, uh, her bosom was very large. So she went under the knife to actually reduce because I think then it was causing her a lot of pain and discomfort. Mm -hmm. And she went to see her doctor, and her doctor advised her, mm -hmm. if I have my facts right, advised her that she probably needs to reduce her bosom. And she did. She went under the knife. Okay. And now she's very close. So I think for those instances where a doctor recommends. Um, for health reasons. For health reasons. Mm. So yeah. So I think okay. It's so you will be the one to answer the, the mm. other side. Of, on what instances do you think is not necessary? Uh, well, from what I've been seeing, where you have before and after, and there's no, you know, you know, I say before and after, where the before or the after is a complete contradiction to the uh, give before. us examples. Uh, <laughs> Don't give I, me surface. Example. I, I used I used to be dark. Yeah. But somehow, I, the I light am, of God. The light of God me. has shone upon my mm -hmm. face, mm -hmm. and I am now brighter than the sun. Mm -hmm. okay. Such that. Um, if I just uh, touch you, your body will start peeling. Okay. Ah. No, it might be like an exaggeration, but I'm sure those extremes actually ah. happen. Yeah, it's possible. I, I, I mean, I don't think that so is So you're necessary. talking about people who kind of like lighten up their skin or bleach or whatever. The, so if you insist, if that's you what think, you want to call yeah, it. Yeah, you think they can... <laughs> you, feel, you feel there is no reason why that is necessary. I don't think so. I don't think so. I don't think that is ever necessary. All right, let that, me just go according to the way we are seated. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I thought you were going to come. Why are you talking to me? <laughs> All right, so um, what do you think? Uh, do you think body going under the knife or uh, enhancing your body any in any reason. form, do you think is necessary? I don't want to sound like a cliche, like I always say. Ah, it's a difficult question. <laughs> of course, it's difficult. That's what we're talking uh, about. It. Is there any reason why anyone would want to change the way they look? Yes, they might have reason to want to change the way they look. Uh, is it necessary? My answer to that is that is it really my question to answer? Because I believe it's based on whatever is happening with that person. So, can you give us examples? I, I want you people to be who's in now. <laughs> who's I, 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 like, I have to be surprised. I have to be calm about this topic because uh, you know what? Okay, I'm so let me. Like, I don't want to. I don't want to. Because I don't want to get to nitty gritty. Is, yeah. I don't want to get to nitty gritty while we're still at the preliminary. So okay. Maybe come back to me when I've heard. Right. Everyone. Yeah. <laughs> when I've heard everyone, then come back to okay. me. Yes, okay. Okay. But okay. Yeah. But from what you're saying, yes. like when you said it's dicey, you mm -hmm. feel that there are some instances where it's necessary, and there are instances where you feel it's an overkill. Necessary like is a strong word to use. Okay. What word would you use? I would say. Are there instances where it might be beneficial to the person? Yes. Does that mean that it was necessary? I don't think so. But okay. it might be beneficial to that. So it might be, we might want to take this on a case by case yes. basis. Oh, definitely. Okay. definitely. Yeah, yeah. I, I get it. It's, as it's as I'm not sense. in that person's shoes, I mean, 
I would like to have six packs and you know broad chest, and, you know. Yeah, I mean and, they are doing and, that and, now. And just you know, just walk so in the streets and you know everyone's looking at wow, what a, what a specimen of God's great work on the man. Yeah, <laughs> I mean I have like a two pack right now. Mm. Uh, all eyes on me. Uh, <laughs> I, I wish you can get to a six pack. I can work on that, but. I mean, is that what I really want to do right now? Not really. Okay, so. Kumi, what do you think? Is it a necessity or can it be a better word? Can it be a necessity, necessity to anyone? Yeah. Hmm. Well, yes, I would say yes. Sometimes it can be necessary. Uh, can you give instances? Um, I would say like, like um, as Koya said, like when it's actually health issues, like when you want to do like... um. Um, boobs reduction or something like yeah. I've had people like I have a friend that she has she had to do it because it was really bothering her and some people like when they've been trying to lose weight for so long and they can't and they've gone to the gym it's not like yeah. they've not gone to the gym as people say they've worked hard like for some people it's just not as easy as what it is and mm-hmm. some people don't have the patience they would rather pay for the time yeah as opposed to using that time in the gym they'd rather just walk out of that time and pay a doctor so it's necessary as I hate to argue with this guy, but like, as he said, it's not my it's not my place to tell the you. Voice of reason. It's, it's, it's not my place to tell you because I'm not in your shoes, right? Yeah. And it would be unfair to tell you like, oh, you shouldn't do this when you're not in that person's Which shoes. Is, sorry, is makeup body enhancement? It's part of it. No, it's not. It is. Yeah. It is. You see what I did body there? You see what I did there? I think it is. <laughs> you're increasing your body. No, no, it's just that, like... That's not what enhancement it is. means. Yeah, enhancement is... You're improving... You're doing something to make it look different. Uh, but, but Whether it's a big minor change or a major. Yeah, but, but, but in the... Con- yeah. We're now going into the dimension. We're not yet there. Okay, so there's temporary enhancement. And <laughs> permanent yeah, enhancement. Yeah, I, yeah I, I, I think we should deal with because the, the permanent day, you enhancement. In case you did not know for our viewers, yeah. uh, Kumi is a... Is a world-class... World makeup class up artist, yeah, yeah, most not just makeup, after. most sought after makeup. Mm-hmm. Artist. See, of Toronto, <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, so I this don't think is... it's it actually because it's something that you can take off at the end of the day, yeah. Mm. So, um, but to answer your question, to some people, it's absolutely necessary, and I'm not, it's not my place to tell them it's not mm. the wizard okay. by the book, <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, I think we all agree. At, I'm also on the same page with three of you. Like, there are some instances where it is necessary, necessary yeah. and instances where you feel like, why are you only doing it? You know, why? Like, what? what, what? So, that takes me to the angle of um, insecurity. A lot of people jump at. It's very, like, sometimes when I see people jumping at other people at, on social media, why would you change your body? Yeah. Uh, you feel you're not good. You know, you're not good, good looking enough for the man or something. You know, people go t- to extremes. And I think in my mind that, if really, if everybody's really, you know, clamoring and shouting and saying that this thing is, is not good, why do we have a lot of people still going for it? Do you get what I mean? Yeah. Sometimes, in the back of my mind, I feel that the same set of people that are like, why is this girl doing that? The same people, it. yes, they are making research, going <laughs> to do that. It's check. probably because of the money that they've not done it yet. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. And then you see a lot of people doing it. And I actually watched someone's um, blog. Yeah. She took back her words. She was on YouTube. Yes. Actually yeah. saying that. I know she people. Do, yes. And then she took back words. I, I feel I should do it and all of that. So do you think there's a salient um, aspect of oh, insecurity there? Oh, definitely. Then? Definitely. So for, for the uh, plethora of people that we see, go under the knife okay uh, to a large extent is because they are uncomfortable mm-hmm. with some part of their body or how they look or maybe when they try to compare themselves with mm-hmm. others yeah they now see ah it would have been good though if my airline stops receding you know well that is a choice so that's not... an announcement too oh it, yeah, is, it, it is. is oh it is it is mm. it is oh, you have plans you're thinking of <laughs> Look at your head. Look at my head. Uh, no, I'm just. Me, me, I'm whose hair is receding? No, I'm so comfortable much. with mine. I mean, my, my, mine is awesome. Please, mine viewers, is, whose hair my, looks like mine is awesome. Kumi, uh, 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 let's take the battle away from you. what do you think? Do, do you think um, you ha- is an obvious case of insecurity? I feel like everyone is insecure about something. Mm. It's, it's going to be an to to each his own. Well, that's what she thinks. That oh, is now, awesome. if it's something that bothers you a lot that you want to fix it, yeah, it, it's a personal thing. As you said, it's kind of like a thing of it's a case by case scenario, right? And 
the way the world is it's like you can really fi- you can pretty much fix everything mm-hmm. true like true. and ha- would you say like okay for a woman that has a woman that had the really nice figure she got married pregnant, she got yeah. pregnant she's giving birth to her three kids she does not like her body mm. and she knows she's done giving birth but she wants to feel good about herself mm-hmm. okay she goes and does this body enhancement yeah. she feels good even her husband can see that he's like okay i'm happy that you love yourself yeah now is that is that necessarily a bad thing you know is that necessarily an insecurity of ours yes but it's something that she fixed it okay. so sometimes those insecurities might not be bad i'm not the one to say when it's good and when it's bad it's not my place to do mm-hmm. that but i feel like everybody is insecure about something the choice that you want to be mad, <laughs> i don't care <laughs> No, 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 no. <laughs> it's just something that occurred to me, but go ahead, okay. I, I'll so, wait. Um, so, if it's, if it's in your, if it, oh, sorry, I lost my train of thought, but what I pretty much want to say You is, are saying that you are not in place to say. Yeah, it's not my place to say Um, if you need to go fix it up or yeah. anything like that. What I would say is, um, be careful. True. Because, and I don't want to jump the gun, but I've heard it's very addictive okay yeah it's just like like let's not even go far like painkillers right actually women when you have cramps let me speak for myself now i don't even want to go through the pain of cramps i'm just like let me just use this thing before it comes like, exactly before it comes and it's it gets worse over time because before i could see even bear the pain but i'm like why am i being pain okay, i'm going just like to suffer painkillers this is just but it, it can get really addictive and i know people that have told me that once you go one, you yeah. want to, because you want to fix yeah. something, yeah. and you will always see something seeking perfection. Yes, exactly. <laughs> You're seeking perfection. You're seeking yeah. that validation. So yeah. it is. It's a sense of insecurity. But like, I don't know if you can say, oh, you can control yourself to stay after this one. But that's a lie. So mm, really? Say, yeah, I don't think you can. Control yeah, you, 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 you only have very few it's people. Very, yes, very you say it's, it's it's a lie. It's a facade. Because that. there's always something so, so to correct. what's your take? Do you think it's a uh, you have some salient issues with insecurity for you to uh, fix so something? That, that was why I, 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 when she said insecurity, I kind of thought about it. Is it really always a case of insecurity? What do you think? Think about it this way. Like I, I drive, let's say I drive a, I drive a, a, a Mazda 3. Yeah. Uh, and then tomorrow I decide to get a Lamborghini. Was it because I was insecure about my Mazda 3? I just wanted something better. Does it necessarily have to be with I was insecure about what I had before? Let, let's think about it from that from that point of view. The context of better would presuppose that the way you look now, mm-hmm. if the announcement you want to do mm-hmm. is not improving your health, mm-hmm. so it presupposes that the way you look now is not good. No. When I had the Master 3, it wasn't because I wasn't enjoying my Master 3. You it, just it, felt you could upgrade. Yeah, I just and felt you had I could the resources upgrade, to upgrade. And I had the resources to do it. And then coming to what you had mentioned earlier about people being able to just get their body enhanced. Yes, they can. They can do anything, but to various varying degrees of risk. Yes. yes. So that's where I, I draw the line. Depending on what you're looking to do, yeah. what is the risk factor? Mm. If the risk factor to whatever it is that you're trying to enhance is 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 probably going to cause Very you more much. harm yeah. than good then why yeah. Yeah. that's where that's where my questions come in why would you want to risk yeah. your health to just look and the truth of the matter is even if you don't have the discipline to maintain the whatever thing that you you built you probably go back to square one yeah mm. so what have you gained Okay, so let me just take it right from there. So yeah. the very, let me eat the nail on the head. One of the things that people say is that, or let me say one of the selling points, the marketing strategies, they tell you that, because I've, I've mm-hmm. done my research. Yeah. They, I they don't know really say because I've enhanced my body. <laughs> <laughs> no, this one is for local. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so what they tell you is that um, the risk yeah. involved in having a liposuction or a mini tummy tuck is mm-hmm. almost the same thing as having a cesarean section. That's one of the selling lines that you For hear real? from people. Yeah. To be real, some I don't have the... any issues with liposuction. Yeah. So what that is you. But with... some people, but those are one of the like... Brazilian. <laughs> yeah. So, so, <laughs> so what I'm trying. Uh, sorry, let me gather my thoughts yes, together. Okay. So what I'm trying to say is that one of like the common ones that people do is liposuction, mini top, mon, BBL. Mini, yeah. 
Well, yeah, but people feel that, you know, the ones that are easy to come by and, you know, at least it's, it's still, they feel it's still a minor enhancement is liposuction and mini, mini tummy tuck. You have the Brazilian butt lift and all of that. Mm -hmm. But those ones, I would say that maybe not everybody's doing it. But the ones that everybody has yeah. done, are the top three. Are you Ma sure not everybody? Many doing people. Oh, actually, hey. people. Hold on yeah. now. Hold yeah. on. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I, what, I feel that, um, let's look at it from that risk because you mentioned risk. That's why yes, I had a stomach. Yes, yes. If you look at it from the angle of, oh, it's even riskier for me to, or let's say they have the same risk, the cesarean section, which a lot of people jump at mm -hmm. versus having a mini tummy tuck. Would you still, like, would you still, encourage anyone or you feel like eh, it doesn't matter like but, but I just was getting, is there a risk to disregard so, in relation to the example i just gave so for life has a risk no no yes, no so does. so from what i know and i'm, I'm not claiming to be an expert here okay. like you mentioned cesarean sections are is, is an is a procedure that yeah. is you know is, now. Is, is, yeah. should be a norm now it's not a big deal anymore yep there was a time where liposuctions were a lot more riskier, yeah. but because of the advances in medical, uh, health medical, and yeah. surgical, surgery, surgical uh, procedures, it's more or less very low risk now. Yep. Yeah. Now, but when we are now going to the BBLs, and I'm not like I said, I'm not an expert. For me, that's where me I start drawing the line when we start talking about BBLs and all because it's just even seeing videos of people coming back from, from the from the, is as ridiculous. It's, as it is. Okay, it's so ridiculous. what I hear you say is that um, you feel that if, if the risk is, you know, beyond a particular threshold, then yes, it's really not yes, necessary. Yes, it's, it so it's the no weight of the risk for you. Yes, like I said, uh, uh, risk versus reward. R risk we, versus reward. We always have to balance it. Yeah. Like, for me, once it's skewed towards the more, more the risk. riskier, the more rewarding. No, 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 no. <laughs> I mean, as you said, if you drive a Lamborghini, yes, yes, now the riskier, the more high risk I can there's have. No, there's no, there's ah, no. Come on, now. <laughs> come on now. I'm really good to go there. Just so say, if you, if you fly a more rewards, jet, which one has more risk? <laughs> no, the no, private jet. More rewards. Why, why not doing that? Why not doing that? <laughs> okay, do you want to say anything about in terms of the risk? For, uh, I mean, the risk, the risk factor is always there, but I just wanted to clarify that's the you made in, in comparing liposuction with uh, cesarean section. section. Is it medically proven or is it yes, just yes. something that is just I, in the I, air? I was being careful that it's closed because I don't know which one is higher, but I know that it's a very, like, it's almost the same thing. Okay. According to what I read, I just can't remember exactly the um, the risk of maybe all this blood clot, clot thing yeah. and death, risk of death. But I remember that what I read, it's pretty close. And that's one of the selling points that they tell you that, oh, if I can do under a cesarean section, why can't, why can't I? I? Yeah. But do you know, actually even know that there are actually other body enhancements where you don't have to go into surgery? Okay. Yeah. That like, I think there's the one where like, the laser. of the, not, not oh, laser, okay. there's the one where they need your tummy yeah. Yeah. to form what it wants like really? this one it's, it's not you're not going with to surgery with like well, a I learned, I learned that that one is a like, like, yeah, one. like, that, like, that, like that one like, like the one they cold use sculpting. Sculpting. Yeah. like the one they use cold. to make uh, pie no, no not exactly like that like but like that. Uh, no there, there's that one and there's one that they can freeze your fat mm -hmm. But that one you're not wow. going into surgery nothing wow. like Kumi, you're what awake I've, what I've seen with those ones like you don't see the one happens to fat after they freeze it no, like you have to continue. It's not a one-time yeah, thing. One -time thing. Well, neither is surgery. Neither is surgery. <laughs> I, really, I don't. Sometimes I don't blame people when people do this. Like before, I used to have that. Hmm. But the thing is, like for example, I go to the gym a lot. Okay. Yeah. I'm like, see, at what point? <laughs> I if don't know like no me give, myself. <laughs> if anybody not give what it's supposed to give, because now I'm doing it the right way. They say go to gym or go to gym. Eh, 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 eh. <laughs> I go to gym four times a week. But let's see really? the name. So, yes, I go four times a week. Oh, and you, the you Bella in so, and, yeah. And then another thing, another thing that um I realized, you know, when preparing for this topic is that a lot of people actually do it to market other things. Like they're not really yeah, doing true, yeah, true, a lot. True. In yeah. fact, an alarming That's source of income. A, 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 I mean, huh? um, yeah. a source of income to market to that thing. To, like to market. So what? what some markets. what some ladies do markets. is that they actually have maybe like a vendor or somebody that will they want they have it in my mind in their mind that they want to sell a particular medication or consumable, and then they go under the knife, do it, and oh, then they and start then they saying lie that, that, that exactly. Oh, a lot okay. of them. No, not even that one. Like you can actually about. be an influencer, and like and you want to market clothes. Ah, that yeah. one is even. Yes, that no. one is even. Um, this thing. You actually, you are fixing your body. Yes, you want to be an influencer. That one is. Wait, I don't like the way we are, we are focusing on the agenda. 
Now we go to the Okay, the guy. So from your own experience, from the things you've seen, from, from your wealth of experience, what experience you and have, the things you have seen or done. Coming, 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 yeah. coming together, guys. When you all fix your teeth, your yeah. six packs, your airline. We don't yeah. we don't do that. Oh, they do. They don't be do. the no, no, they, they fix their what? Their teeth, yes now. No, they do. Are you, no, but that tells those stars normal. No, 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 no. It's on another level. It's not easy. What do you mean by that? They get grills or what? Which grills? No grills. They want you to look in a certain way. It's not just about it. Yeah. It's not about your teeth. Your white, your teeth is whitening. Like a new, not all this one that you get braces. Also, we're talking about dental as enhancements. Like yeah, yes, of body no. Like the way people fly to Turkey for body enhancements or like BBL and all that, people fly to Turkey. For and people like permanently dental change stuff. the color of their uh, eyes. Is it yeah, eyes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, I think I saw someone yeah. that went Imagine. blind as a result of the color of their, color of their, of their people. Why? So, you know, like green, you, you want it to be green, you want it to be blue. Why make them what sexy or what? Would you, yeah, call, what I mean. wait, would you call microblading wait, body enhancement? What? It is, it is makeup is body enhancement for me. It's just that, like you said, it's temporary. Yeah. Anything that you can take off at the end well, of the so, day, yeah. I don't think it's body enhancement. But you enhance it while at that moment. Well, looking at the definition of enhancement, makeup. For the other definition, but for the context of this conversation, oh, it's, it's permanent. permanent. The permanent. So it's the permanent enhancement we're talking about. But so even the ones, you know, like, even the ones we're referring, we're referring to. Yeah. The idea is not for you to do a one-off and go. You're supposed to like maybe I don't Cont- know maybe after every years or something. No, you're supposed no. to do one-offs. Trust but me, it's not. It doesn't work that way. It just, no, 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 no. That's the thing. That's the thing. Really? Do they do continuous liposuctions? Ah, uh, uh, they do. Why it's they continuous. Do continuous you, liposuction. you go back and then they check it. Let me it. tell you. You, you. They, it's not a, like you so do the first one. You go back and do it again. Why? Ah, uh, was, was, it wasn't flat enough the first time. <laughs> it wasn't. It wasn't flat Especially enough. okay. So for liposuction, what I know is that they are in two categories. Or let's just do. Let's give it a broad categorization. Yeah. You have the one where you take stuff away, and you have the one where, where you, you add insert stuff. stuff. Yeah. For yeah. the ones where you take stuff away, you may necessarily not have to go over. Yeah. So to me, the ones that take stuff away makes sense. Yeah, it makes sense. It's the one where they add stuff that I'm like. But uh, when you uh, add uh, stuff, no, 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 no wait. Foreign body. Let's just say, for example, now you take fat away from your waist. Yeah. You could, yeah. Some people throw it away. They throw it away. But some now you want your butt to be bigger. Now you're gonna. Why do you it. want your butt to be bigger? My G. Oh. Some people. <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> yeah. people. No, no, no. I just want to know. <laughs> why? Them, why? No, no. Because, 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 we'll get their number so you, you can good. ask them. No, no, no. Because I, I feel like if we don't go into the why, we're not doing this. Uh, Very topic, true. And we're, we're going to go justice. We're gonna go yeah. into that. Like, Remember, why? we're taking it one step. More often than not, insecurity, I think, is one is one major reason. Yeah. Is one major reason. Another reason might be uh, the process of where you think that, oh, I've always wanted to oh, look like this. Is this going to agree, like avarice? Uh, I don't think it's... Think it's well, the, it's the avarice great. part might be where you now want to be a marketer because of that. You don't think no, about marketer. You just feel like it's not big enough. I want to make it bigger. That's what happens yeah. on yeah. the second it? time. Okay, so... Avarice now. Oh, really? Yes. Thank, that's thank you, for, thank you for, for bringing this up. Yeah. Now, is there anything wrong with you wanting it to get bigger? For your own personal reasons, right? Not and, and just all of my it. It No, even if it, there's, there's no big deal. For me, I'm speaking for myself. Although I tried as much as possible not to like give my own opinion on this topic, but personally, I feel like Kumi said everybody is insecure about something. So if I have maybe like a very big bulge under my yeah. my tie or something, and I'm always trying to hide it, like I'm always wearing flowy skirts. Wait, wait. Wh- why it... do we agree that everybody's insecure about something? Though? No, I do not. I do I not agree. So. I not. No, I don't follow another a category. Great number. Okay, maybe it's great number. Let's say from the familiar perspective. Are you not insecure about? Is there something that everybody? Is, is there something everyone? I, I said so. every female has something insecure about. No, don't do female. Let, 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 let me. For me, I'm insecure about everything. Let me put. I feel like most people are. Most people. I will. I will rephrase. I will say that. Everybody asks something they wish was better, or if they have a way of hiding it from people, they will. Like something that not I, 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 I agree. Everybody has one. wishes. If wishes are all men will fly. Yeah, but fly imagine you had a million dollars to make that, that wish to come make true. To make that wish come true. You have the resources to I make it I might want to go feed kids in that. Uh, you, well, you can well, go well, feed them, but you have enough money. Imagine you had one million dollars. Feeding the kids were like 6,000. And doing BBL was like, oh, enhancement was one Why would I want to do a BBL? Whatever. Enhancement. Okay. $1,000 out of one million. Moving. Or let me say, let's make a progress we moving since. Yeah, we're taking baby steps. Better word, moving on. So another subtopic. And that is the intention behind it. Like Tizu mentioned, Mm -hmm. he touched on your intention about 
anything. What what are valid intentions? Well, um, well, a solid one is always altruism. For yeah. altruism, how about you? Valid intentions not to do or to, to do. do. To do. To do. What's the reason? What would you so, think? So I I, I, I wouldn't else? hold it against people that want to improve out the I I so, so this is the solution I'll go to here is all things are permissible, not all things are profitable. Okay. So if you look at it from that lens and then you balance the risk to the to the reward. If your reward outweighs your risk, I have no issues with whatever it is that you But what kind of rewards about. are we talking about? There's nothing wrong in wanting to look good. I, I don't I don't for one have any so what Problem about people, for example, look at a, a guy that has a receding hairline. Now that uh, 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 health procedures and technology has made it possible for you to reclaim back your lost gloom, yeah, <laughs> go enjoy mouse, look into that. Uh, I looked into it, but uh, I like, no, I'm comfortable about it. Right, what, so what, 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 what if you're already looking good and you want to look better, 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 better? Still the same risk versus you reward. You feel that's not funny. Risk versus reward. reward. So if I want to look, stop? if I want to look, for example, it's like I, I have a I have a barber that cuts my hair, and I found one that cuts it better, and makes me look better. I'll go to the other guy. So far as the risks are weighs the reward. I so mean, at what point no, no will you stop? When the risks are weighs the reward, that's where you draw the line. <laughs>
compared to now, advancement then and the advancement has now, caught up to the point that a liposuction is probably a basic procedure, simple as going to get your teeth filled. Yeah. Mm. That's how relatively easy and uh, safe it is to do now. So for me, it's not an issue. It's the, 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 the air transfer please, that guys do now. Very straightforward. Tizo, can you please give me a real life example of the one you feel that it's a no no regardless of whether technology has improved or not the two weeks that do you have any one oh, well, that be one I, 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 because I if technology weeks, improves just like the example fine. you gave now if technology improves and so that you just days, enter one place are you hold on hold on wait 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 if technology improves, and they don't have to go to the kind of airplane that they are not doing like this are you fine with this is that is the risk I'm, I'm, I'm not even sure want... I can be fine with it. And the most important thing, and most important thing, if the motive behind it is purer, because that I feel that for that's BBL, that's 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 for that BBL, that's that's that motive is always let me just stop traffic with this thing that is just yeah, rolling up and down. Are you not coming to I'm not, I'm not, I don't, I don't traffic, go across my head to be talking traffic. Traffic, traffic does, does not stop, stop if, stop. if yeah. I get What is the most of going now. to go and, go and get a, a, another baba that's going to make cut your I want to look good. So the people doing BBL, they want she to But is it the Anyash that we are going to go and be looking good? The people doing BBL, No, 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 because what are the problem with this? Hold on, hold on. I think Koye was trying to talk. Hold on, hold on. Part of the problem with this generation that me I had, I think I've brought it up with a couple of my friends before, is why is it that you want to take a display picture and you are standing like this? <laughs> it's a display picture. It's your face that we are trying to where, see. Why is, why is it so? Why are you moving to the side? <laughs> Koye, Talk, no, talking talking about something. motive, right? Yeah. I there are some I don't think I will ever agree with. If ultimately liposuction, there's a reason for liposuction, and it has been medically proven that um, it is ultimately beneficial to the patient um, in terms of what it does or the effect. Uh, Tommy talk more often than not when the risks are not that high. I think can be permissible. Although, unfortunately, we had stories. I think there was yeah, yeah. Um, Kanye's mom, yeah, mm -hmm. and the former first lady yeah. of the country. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So those risks exist, but there are some where I've never seen that the motive can be germane. Okay. And. I think it will take a lot for for me to be convinced that this is actually working. Okay, bringing it back home because we don't have a lot of time. Do you think it's Christian? Um, to one of them. It's not. It's, <laughs> you, know, uh, you know when you, when, when you ask that question, you stick to that. I say where it's not Muslim, <laughs> but I just changed my mind. <laughs> should they okay? Should a Christian consider? I, I just want us to be very real here. Don't cut into on the topic. Should a can, is it okay for a Christian to consider a tummy talk? It is not on okay. <laughs> Are you speaking? He's speaking it is not on okay. Okay. But um, I think wait, wait, I'm sorry. I it think, is not. It is so. It is okay. It is not on okay. I stand by what I say. <laughs> okay, go but, on. But, but I think um, there's a scripture that particularly just seals it up. I wish I could quote it but I think it's First Peter. Three, three. Mm -hmm. uh, that talks about do not let your, your beauty your, shouldn't be about your garments uh, be outside, but let it be mm -hmm. inside. I'm paraphrasing it. Um, in the context of the Bible, when you look at where uh, and you've also put some um, references uh, talking about your body being the temple of the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. Now, if you say, "Is it Christian?" What you're asking is that are there instances in the Bible where it is permissible? That's not what I'm not... asking. What I'm asking is, do you think it's it's not against the Real so, so God. if if you have a check in your spirit, mm. and when you look at ultimately what the Bible says about adornment, I mean, when you look at um, um, throughout the scriptures where the Bible even talks about in the Old Testament, when you look at um, uh, where, where the scripture now, uh, it's come to me where there were prescriptions on how people should look. Mm -hmm. uh, there were prescriptions on how. You should not let your outwardly appearance. Yeah, your something like something like that. So when you now look at that, mm -hmm. and you see that there are permissible instances in the Bible where adornments are necessary, mm -hmm. as long as it does not um, ultimately give you a facade of um, a facade of uh, you want to be the one that's bringing uh, all the glory to yourself. Bringing all the glory to yourself, where mm -hmm. you are now. I'm the guy. I'm the main guy. Mm -hmm. I mean. 
You don't become self-conceited, basically. That's the word, self-conceited, where you don't do these things to be put in a place of, oh. I'm the guy, I'm the... What I hear you say is that, so you, it's not unchristian. I don't think it's it's not unchristian. You just Because there are, to... there are many things in the you, Bible you... where you would not uh, see the Bible say, do this, do that. Okay. But because we, teach... we, can, we can expand this to a lot of things. Okay. And, and I think this came up in the conversation that we, we I have with one of our friends, like, to the point that we're talking about IVFs. Yeah. True. Let, let us not go far. So, <laughs> Tizu, answer the question. Do you mm -hmm. think that it is Christian or it's unchristian? Everything that I've said previously is still, it's still, it's still, 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 still You feel still that the there's nothing thing. stopping a Christian from... Nothing doing, stops you. From considering... Risk versus reward, motive. Yep. Uh, motive. motive is the key thing to everything. Why are you doing this? Why? Come is it because you want to be the one stopping traffic? Is it because what, you saw somebody and like, oh, I want to have that as well? Tizu, no, why are you wearing a, an orange shirt and it's matching your shoelaces? I like to look good. There's nothing wrong with looking good. Okay, it could be what do you <laughs> think? Even like BBO, they want to look good too. No, people, no, are, people no. are all BBO. You don't get to pick they want and to look, choose they, no, they want to look, look good. good for a reason. Who do you but want to look good reason. for? What's the reason ah. you want to look good? Okay, so what's the reason you see, want to see, look good? See, notice, notice how. No, no, what is the reason you want to look good? Calm down. Oh my God. Notice how the look good was not look good, but. <laughs> okay, <laughs> guys, I think. What is look, the reason you want to look good? Why is he looking like, here? It's like, it's like, not you're here. Super Mr. Bond. Why, why, why is he not here? Why is he. Why is he. That's, that's, that's why. Let's come together. Let's come together. I feel like this topic is. Let's say the truth. Exactly. I think there is one. We have our different angles and perspectives, but there's one thing that. That all of us, you know, I think I we agree know. to, which is the motive behind yeah. what you're doing. Actually, I have not answered this. No, no. <laughs> okay. She doesn't agree. Kumi, no. is it Christian? Is it unchristian to um, want to do body enhancements? Is it unchristian? I <laughs> a little backer. <laughs> um, it that it's it's hard. It, I would not. Uh, is it on Christian? It's, no, I do. You go speak to Elia. No, no, no. The reason say why. It, the say reason why. Say that. Let there be a shame. Like I would say that. Um. Uh, like um, how, how would I phrase it now? It's more so like I don't think as a Christian you should, but it's not my place to judge, okay. because God in the Bible says judge not. Okay, so that's hold on. I don't think it's my place to judge. So if you want to do it, that's fine. I think what it is is what I think is the only people to check your heart and yeah. which boils down to the motive. Kumi, this about what, to make wait, up too. what happens is what happens is when if you're doing it for whatever motive it is, if you're not worshiping your body. Okay. Because that's where it is. Because when we have this thing that we start worshiping and we take our eyes off God. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. So now it depends on your motive. And it's very difficult to say that when you obviously even when you dress well. This is you know you don't you are feeling yourself you're on top of the world. True. When it's like how far is like when um, when you now look at you're fixing yourself to look a certain way and this is permanent. It's really it's going to be hard for you to say oh I'm not going to hype myself or gas myself even even when you apply makeup and you look good that you um, can take off you will gas yourself up. So I would say that it's hard to not it's hard to not it's hard to do it and still feel. Like you're not worshiping yourself. That's why I feel like yeah. no, it's it's not right for a Christian to do it. But honestly, so we should not judge people that do makeup. On, no. Honestly, um, we could go on and on and on on this topic, and I don't see us concluding whether it's Christian or unchristian because I I see a lot of us tending to one one side than the other. But it would be lovely to have your 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 view. What do you think? Like, share, comment. Like, share, comment, <laughs> subscribe, and also. Give us your feedback. What's your opinion? What Depends. do you think about this body <laughs> enhancement of it? All right. Till the next episode. Bye, guys. Bye.